Good morning and welcome. It's Chilly Coo from Sunshine Coast here in Queensland, Australia. Coming to you with a very quick test. Well, maybe quick, maybe long, I don't know. So I've got this 40 centimetre round here and I'm going to try this little um, flower cup thing that I've been sent from an Australian guy that makes these particular um, cups for pouring in different shapes. He makes the chamber cups and this one is the flower cup. It's in two pieces, this particular one. So I've tried it another way, the other way, and I'm trying it this way today to see what I can get from this particular little gem. I am going to use the Montmart pouring paints. Um, I'm just thinking that these might be the perfect consistency without having to do anything to them because they're all they're pre-made paints so and they're that the little bit thicker so they might hold the shape better I'm thinking with the um, kind of flower effect I would like to get from this I'm just thinking now that I maybe should put this canvas onto the lazy susan -y thing to see yeah if I want to spin it spin it spin it I probably should cover that up but it looks a bit ugly but we'll just go with it and see how we go I'm also testing out um, my new iPhone 11 Pro Max <laughs> to see if it films better than my other I used to film off my iPad so I'm going to see if this one works. I'm also using a little um, a remote on that's attached to my, uh, what you call them, telescopic things that go up and down the stand. So I'm, I'm actually testing a few things out here. So just wish me luck and let's, um, let's get on with it. I've just got a selection here that I'm gonna just, I'm just gonna go with it. So see how we go. So there's all the, oh, they, these paints just need a really, really good shake. They're very highly pigmented. So you definitely need gloves because if they get onto your skin, they really do stain. I've got a mark on me, a pink on me somewhere that I've had on about three days. And I have showered in between, honestly, so. Give them a really good shake, shake it up, baby, and um, go from there. So let's get this show on the road. I probably should have done all the measurements and see that I've got it dead center, but I'm not that kind of person. I don't like measures and preciseness. I like flying by the seat of my pants and just doing what comes whatever comes to my mind without having to overthink it. I can get away with it now I'm older. Obviously when you feel you're younger and everybody expects everything to be perfect from you, you can't get away with it so much, but who cares? Now I'm just doing what gives me joy and that's it. So that was the gorgeous light aquamarine. And so, so how easy can it be just pouring straight from the bottle? That one is the Fuelo Turquoise. Fuelo Turquoise. This is the Rose Gold. And I go to the tur just plain old, tur oh, plain old turquoise. And I'm going to go the pink, Lily the pink, oops. This canvas might need quite a bit of paint. So maybe I might go around the very edges with uh, some white. This one is dark green. You 
go back to the rose gold. Oh yes, very interesting using these cups. I'm gonna throw, I've got a little bit, I'm not sure if I've got much in here, Shiraz, but I would like some in, so I might open another bottle. Oh, no, okay, not much in there. Oh, that is a nice color though. That is a gorgeous color. I think I have a little bit of gold left. If not, I'm going to open a new one because I love, love, love this gold. Shimmery, shimmery. Go back to this blue. So it's just a nice, calm, relaxing pour just to see how this turns out on this particular, um, add a little bit of black in here, canvas with these pouring paints and this new um, cup from the 3D printer that a, gim a guy named Tim Husband and I will put the link to his email if you want to contact him about these particular cups. He's got all sorts of split chambered cups or these one for making like a flower. So I'm not sure if Tim is um, sending stuff out of Australia at this point or is just concentrating on the Australian market. to that Shiraz again if I can find one. Oh, I don't think I've got them. Oh, I have, I have, I have. Good oh, good oh. These seem, these paints seem particularly good for just, um, for me, for pouring, like ring pouring, they're particularly good. For, for pores where you don't want cells in them, you can create cells by adding silicone to the paint, but if you don't want cells, then you just pour it directly from the bottle. And this is what you will get. might give that whole thing a little turn. Do you think I should or shouldn't? Oh my goodness. Should I risk it for a Swiss kit? Okay.
<laughs> maybe going overboard here but i'm enjoying myself and it feels relaxing so you just literally go with the flow pour your little heart out and um, be happy about it where did my gold go oh, thought i had some more done that one done that one Yeah, I think just one little bit of black now. And then we'll remove the gadget. I might let the um, paint come off, completely come off the cup itself. Um, move my paint. So if I spin this spinner, I won't knock all everything over. Okay, so, okie dokie, let's get this, oh, maybe just a little bit of this skin, a little bit. It's so bright and gorgeous, I love it. I love it. Okay, crazy lady, crazy lady, okay. Let me know what this camera angle and if it's too close too far away is it clear i've got overhead lights above so i just sort of you know if you've watched a lot of my other videos you will kind of be able to um compare the two the camera and the angles and um yeah let me know so i can work on um, trying to you know get better quality videos and from a a technologically challenged mama okay let's remove this i'll remove slowly 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 ew wow is this trousers oh look at that in the center that's interesting isn't it okay i'm going to i will go out Just with the skewery stick. Now I'm going to run it in the other way. Why is it going over one side and not the other? <laughs> Went over here nicely, but it's not. Turn it around. Let me see if I can. Maybe it's the things out of balance. Covering this beautifully. Keep going, come on, you good thing. <laughs> Give it a little bit of help over there. If 
funny, I love all this outside, but I don't love that centerpiece. So I'm not sure how I would go about making sure I don't get that in the center because the rest of it, look at that. <laughs> it's uh, really intriguing, really intriguing. Look at that. I like it. Okay, I'm going to have a think about that because I don't like that there. So, ah, oh, any ideas? I'm not too worried that's come over the edge beautifully all around here let's see just a little bit there it's not too bad though but I don't know what to do about this centerpiece so I will have to have a little think about it and um, see what I can do but if any of you have got any ideas, please do let me know. Okay, I just ring poured, which I thought I'd got the camera on. I just put poured uh, a ring of the, the pink, the green, the blue, the, the um, what do you call it? The peachy color, pink. Um, the blue and the black and then I just use my skewer to um, separate it like this so I'm going to and then out on some of them I'm gonna see if spinning I just want to get rid of some of that middle that's not very interesting I don't find I mean, this is what I don't like here, but it kind of looks marbly as it's drying. So I'll see if I can get anything happening. Oh, they look kind of reminds me a bit of a peacock. It's like peacock colors. Kind of reminds me of lots of things. I'm sure it will remind you of lots of things. Um, yeah, I'm not such a keen on the middle bit. But all in all, that isn't too bad, is it? It's not too bad. Um, I will see how it dries. Hey, hey, no, that's naughty. My dogs have decided to have a play around here, right in front of me. So I'm gonna leave it with you. It's a bit of an odd one. I'm not, I'm not quite sure about it. I'm gonna let it dry off a bit and see what I think about it. I will post photos at the end and um, yeah, let me know what you guys think. Just go, hey, 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 that's a hit. Just give it a hit, a bit of a hit with the uh, old heat one. I'm not expecting any cells to come up because I haven't put any silicone in it. But it's interesting. I don't know if it's interesting, but, but ugly. Hey, hey, Benson. Come out. Okay, bye for now guys. Let me know what you think. Hey. Um, thank you for watching. I'll be here again tomorrow with another little test with this particular phone. So wish me luck and um, yeah, please let me know what you think of the, the camera looked better, worse. I need to change the angle. Yeah, anything constructive, I, I'm quite happy to receive. So thank you very much for joining me. Bye for now.